In this video, we'll be using Microsoft Excel 2010 to show how to programmatically remove the grid lines from a worksheet or a workbook. Now, this is still a common question that I get asked is how do you remove the grid lines even without using programming? So a quick demonstration, you simply go to the View tab in Microsoft Excel and either checkmark or uncheckmark the grid lines option. Now, to get into the programming, what I'm going to do is go to my Developer tab and I'm going to do Insert on my ActiveX controls, I'm going to select a command button just so I can have a command button where I'm going to assign code. So while in design mode, I'm going to double click my command button. And as you see right now, I have active window dot gridline color index equals zero. This is not a topic I'm going to be discussing in, in this specific tutorial, but I mean, in a later video, I'm going to discuss the gridline color index where you can change the colors of your, of your color index. So here let me go on and show you what we're going to do for the grid lines being displayed. We have three sheets, raw data, sheet two, and sheet three. Now if I just wanted to hide the grid lines from the raw data tab, this is what we would do. It's going to be active window that display grid lines equals false. And if we were to take us out of design mode, hit the command button, the grid lines disappear. If we click the button again, they don't reappear because we have it set to being false. But let's just say that we wanted to change sheet three at, or sheet two, and we didn't want to show the user that we're navigating through these sheets to modify the, the view of it. Let me show you how we would do that. Go back into design mode and double click the command button. The very first thing that you would want to do is to application dot screen updating equals false. This will freeze the screen while we make any changes in the background. And the next thing that you're going to do is get the active sheet name. Active sheet name equals, and then we're going to just all we're going to do is type in active sheet dot name. The next thing that we're going to do is select the tab that we want. So I'm going to do sheets, and I'm going to select sheet three. That's the one that I want. I'm going to select that. And then we're going to do active window that display grid lines equals false. And then what we're going to want to do is navigate back to the active sheet we had in the beginning. And then we got to select we got to type in select. And then the last thing that we're going to do is turn back on the screen updating. Screen updating equals true. And let's just try playing this code now. After I click the command button, sheet three, these grid lines should disappear. So let's go on and try this out. Notice that we didn't see any kind of screen flickering while we click the button. If we go to sheet three, the grid lines are now invisible. That, that concludes this tutorial, guys. Thank you for watching.